Well, hello, boys and girls. I'm Sister Lisa, grand star to my grandchildren, Israel, Judah, Gracelyn, Jeremiah, and Raylan. And I'd like to tell you all today how much I love you. My devotional today was talking about I'm living my resume. I know you've heard me talk about how I have worked at different jobs doing sign language and different things. And I know you're learning some sign language. It says talk to the deaf. And I know mommy teaches you guys in sign language. Your mommies teach you sign language. And I know that sometimes you watch me on here. I love you. And today Mark and Sandy, they're going to be talking about how we're glad to be in God's service. We're going to sing a song, glad to be in God's service. And see, Mark doesn't have any feet, but yet he's still the feet of Jesus because he's at your house and he's at my house. And he's a lot of places. He gets to go places on the internet that yeah you can even go there on your feet that's right I'd have to be in a car and when I'm in a car I walk with my feet to get in and out of the car but if I'm driving my feet touch the gas and brakes pedals but if I'm not driving I'm just sitting there my feet just go to sleep most of the time yeah that hurts when your feet go to sleep it does it really does how do you know Mark uh, I'm just guessing. I was seeing if you'd pay attention to me. <laughs> My feet's never going to sleep because I don't have any feet. <laughs> That's true, Mark. Well, is Sandy going to come over here and sing with us a song that Papa sang and we can join in? It's called Glad to Be in God's Service. You know, he didn't have to let us live. He didn't have to wake us up this morning and start us on our way. So we went, we get to go to Sunday school. That's right. You wouldn't get to go to Sunday school or some of my grandkids go on the bus for bus ministry. Oh, that's right. Going bus ministry, picking up kids and taking them to church to let, so they can hear about Jesus. Oh, that's really neat. It is neat. And sometimes there might be some deaf kids that come and they'll need to know that somebody at the church knows sign language and can sign to them. And even if you didn't know anything else, and I know you do, Mark, and I know you do, Israel and Judah and Graceland and Jeremiah, and I think Raylan's going to be learning, too, how to sign Jesus with the hands. Sign Jesus loves you. That's right. You can tell boys and girls that. And you can learn so much more. Well, Mark and Sandy are going to sing this song. And I want you to sign it. Uh, yeah, sign it if you know it. Glad to be in God's service. Happy, happy to be in God's service. Service like that. Or you can do work that for service because that's what it's talking about, working for Jesus. Say, happy Jesus work. There's different ways you can sign. There's not a perfect one way. But to get the point across to tell people that you're glad to be in God's service, you're glad. See, your face smiles when you go up and your heart is happy. It's full of joy. Glad. And if you want to sign every word, you can, but you don't have to. But if you're going to do glad to be in God's service. Or you could even sign church. Like I said, work. We're glad to be in God's work. So there's different signs. So there you know that. So sing along. Oh, he didn't have to let me live. Right? That's part of the song. He didn't have to let me live. He didn't have to. You just say, he didn't have to let me live. We don't have to sign every word, remember? Glad to be in God's service. Okay, let's do that song if we can do it right now. I can get it to play. You sing along too, okay? <laughs>
and I know you are too. So you have a wonderful day and know that I love you. Remember you can do love, love, love. So much love and so many ways to show love. You show mom and daddy love by helping them out and being of service to them. And you show Jesus you love him by being his hands and his feet and his mouthpiece. So let's be glad to be in God's service. One more time every day. Not one more time like this is the last time I'm going to do it. No, one more time. He gave us a chance every day. One more time plus one more time plus one more time plus one more time. As many times as he lets us. Every morning he wakes us up as a day to work for Jesus. And be glad to be in God's service. Okay, you have a wonderful day. I love you. Bye-bye.